Hello guys and welcome to another wonderful edition of sharing my ideas and on this episode we'll be discussing about how I created this um, simple e-business flyer so um, it's actually my business flyer and I just want to share my ideas on making it and we'll be doing that just right now So guys, welcome back to Photoshop. Um, we'll be creating a new document, and I'm on pixels, and we'll be using 2480 by width and 2480 by height. So you have this already on your screen, and I have a dark background. I actually created this by using um, the fill tool, and I'm bringing in my logo. I already have that selected as well, and you can see that. That. and um, resizing it to be able to resize you can always hit on your control and T for those using Windows and command and T for those who are using Mac so I'll be bringing in the name of my logo as well I already have that created so, so as to save time and, and yeah I have that right now Writing in turning into the document we've already created, and what I'm about to write right now is actually simple, it's just graphics. You can see the text I have already up there. attention just in case you want to fully just follow the same steps I used in making this changing the colors make it brown so it looks much more you know, attractive and having that done I will also be writing in some other sentences into the document we have created um, I would like to call those um, more like um, what the work is talking about, like what your design is talking about. You know, graphic design is all about sending an information, and most of these are just gonna be like the informations of this very e flyer. I have that selected, and our color is going to be white. Basically, I'll be using much more of white colors for this text because you know we already have um, a dark background. We are here for. We are here. What am I writing for? Yo. Just looking up to the test options. Just to check in for the text I'm, us I'm, I'm using for this um, very graphic design. Graphic design. So it's all about advertising, and I'll be writing, you know, contents, the stuffs, um, the business is talking about what the business does. That is all I'll be writing in at this part of um, the design, you know, into the document. So placing in a 
there are different forms of what we do, our services we offer. So you can see flex banner, flyers, wedding cards, brochures, invitation cards, posters, ID cards, general printouts, all over the land, blah, 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 blah. It is there, I got it done. So you can actually, you know, this is all, all about you know, giving on ideas. You can place in, you can also use this kind of design to like create in just about any business um, e flyer or any business flyer at all. So this is just to give you an idea of how to you know, run over it and go over what you want to produce. You can also produce something so much more better than this. You know, this is actually a simple design. So I'll be putting on some something like R also on this part of the design. And this part has our kind of language in all place, you know, from Nigeria. So this is actually Nigerian English vernacular. So that's what I'm going to be using there. So if you are a Nigerian, I'm sure you'll be able to relate to what I'm you know, writing down there right now. And you know, we're having so much fun with that. I'm not just gonna call or pronounce this stuff out because uh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm actually speaking so much English right now. Switching into vernacular seems weird, but you know, I maybe I should say something about it. No, all right, I'll just leave you guys to it. So yeah, whomever is relating to what I'm writing over there, you understand what I'm saying. So, so who isn't relating to it, I'm really just talking about telling people to you know, patronize a business, coming for business and all of that, saying it in our own kind of you know, way, like our own kind of rocky words. And you can see what I did there. I just used the shape tool to create this um, little shape of it. It's just a simple shape. for this design I'm using a pen tool and the magic eraser tool to clear it out I didn't have this already prepared I was actually designing and I just picked out the image randomly and I felt okay this image will work so much well for this design I didn't even really decide to put any image at all when I was designing but along the way I felt it will be you know, much more interesting to add up an image so I selected that image and I feel it works so well with what we're actually talking about you can see her okay hands out popping out showing that all oh, I feel it good to go so um I placed a max icon I'm sorry a max layer to the image to brush down the, the, the down part to actually blend it into the design we are making still doing that so I'm going to be um, that. don't forget you can be able to do this you can hit on your control and T or command and T for Mac control and T for Windows so oh, that's how we're doing An adjustment flare above our image. Remember to click mask, you can see what I just did. Click max it to the image. So I'm reducing the um, brightness, it's looking actually too bright, brighter for the um, the typed work we have already. So I'm um, that's actually an adjustment um, levels filler, and this is a color balance adjustment layer. So I'm going, I'm not going to be click masking this to the whole work because I Really want to use this to blend in the colors of what we have with the image you can see what is going on there already so you can see from the um, logo to the name and everything has um, actually a bluish blending color to the image so that was actually the reason why I had to leave it out there without click masking to so actually make it look much more you know fine so here we are putting on um, phone numbers um, on social media addresses and all of that this is actually 
very common and um, most graphic designs mostly in this part of the world I don't know about other places how they you know most people do the designs actually I've seen so many so many so many tutorials and all of that but you know in Nigeria here this is basically the trend so I'm using it in and uh, okay we'll work our WhatsApp to be cleaning out that from the whatsapp that whatsapp stuff on below the icon so i'm going to be using that later on right now tool to do this you can see from the toolbar where my icons are yeah, basically this is actually a fast tutorial I just don't want to waste so much time going about all of this but is actually basically to share my ideas on how I created this you can actually use this simple steps to actually create basically anything on Photoshop so for as graphic designs on Photoshop are concerned so that's the basic um the basic concept and the basic reasons why I actually am sharing these videos actually to help out Young talented graphic designers who are still coming up, mostly those who are much more interested in doing so much designs in Photoshop to be able to achieve all of their dreams. Okay, we got that going. So, basically, not saying everything I'm doing right now, but I'm showing you the steps right on the screen. I'm adding up a stroke to that YouTube layer just to make it pop up. And the stroke is white. So, just be careful enough to check out exactly most of what I'm doing. Those I'm talking about and those I'm not really talking about because I'm actually doing it a little bit fast to save time. I don't waste so much time doing this so you can you won't feel bored and weary, feel overwhelmed while you know watching the video. So I'm, um, I think by creating a layer above um, the shape we created, I want to add some form of light glow on it. So I'm choosing a color of blue and I'm using the brush too. Make sure you're using a soft light brush. So I, I just hit on, hit, hit on, hit on it, and I hit Control and T to adjust it just as I did. And I'll be duplicating it by pressing Control and J just after I renamed it to light. So I'll be duplicating it right now, and I'm also reducing the opacity. See, I'm, 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 I'm not here, I just duplicated it right now. So, dragging the other one down here so to make our work look so much, 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 much beautiful. You can see that it's looking so much more nice. Uh, okay, maybe I should have just gone back or whatever. Just this is it, and um, we got our design just as we wanted all right so guys thank you so much for watching this video those who stick to the end oh you are my legends you are my stars thank you so much um and to those who have been watching most of my videos and commenting i will really say that i'm so so much grateful and i will still be putting so much more videos to help you guys out with your design works so just tag along stick along 
and I'm assuring you, you won't be disappointed. So guys, peace out. I'll be seeing you guys real soon.